old trooper Newfoundlanders pray hearken unto me and hear your messmates tell you all of the dangers of the sea you all remember Pooch Cove well and the true sun so brave who saved the crew of the water witch so near a watery grave on Christmas Eve this craft did leave as loud the winds did roar and on a reef she came to grief not far from the Pooch Cove shore a place where I'll cut the horrid gulch the schooner headed on and in the twinkling of an Three poor dear souls were gone. Two seamen from the water which leapt when they heard the shock. The rest pulled on to that doomed ship were huddled on a rock. To wait for hours through hell and showers as loud the sea did dash. And see their schooner breaking hard on the cliff. Tropes and lanterns who were brought by kind and willing hands. The shrieks of females in distress our fishermen could not stand. And how to face the horrid gulch, six hundred feet to go. To save those souls half dead with gold, who waited down below. Brave Alfred Moore's Wrecked crew, his heart is filled with hope. Six more brave Pooch Cove men, like heroes, man the rope. And now, a small hand lined by moors, he managed for to lure. Till at the water, which is crew, all landed safe on shore. But hark, another scream is heard. The Another female left below to perish on the rock. When Alfred makes another dash, as loud the wind to roar, and brings a woman in his arms in safety to the shore. The news was soon in town next day about the water wind. The whole community got a shock, the poor as well as rich. The governor soon sent home the word in letters bold and grand to tell the pluck of the fishermen belong to Newfoundland. The Humane Society of Liverpool did very soon send here gold medals for our fishermen that never knew no fear. The governor's lady pinned them on those medals rare and rich. The pooch cold men who saved the lives aboard the water bridge. So here's success to our bold men who risk in storms and breeze. 
their precious lives for saving souls who venture on the seas. May peace and plenty be their lot for this true and sterling band. Brave Alfred Moores and all the rest belong to Newfoundland.